Good morning from Nusa Penida. Today we are visiting three quite hidden gems here on Nusa Penida. These are the least visited spots on the island, so we're gonna go check them out. We are not going to Clinking Beach or Diamond Beach. I've got another video on that if you wanna see it, but these are the secret spots. We're actually traveling in a group at the moment. Um, it's like a group trip, which I've kind of organized. And so we've got a few people with us, but of course, Amelia is in here as well. Hello. We are staying in Namaste bungalows and this place is really, really cool. It's beautiful. So we're gonna jump in the car and head to our first spot. Hello, so we are gonna be arriving in 20 minutes. How's the other car doing over and out? We are running smoothly on schedule over and out. Cool. We are on time for the program. So we've just arrived at Pangu One Waterfall. Um, we are walking down these blue stairs and we've got the team here, Rachel behind us and in front of us. And oh, everyone else behind Everyone else behind and we don't need to we don't need to, wow these stairs are actually quite crazy. They're really they're they're really really narrow actually. So we're heading down to a waterfall. I don't really know what it's like, um, but hopefully it'll be cool. Wow, look at that. That looks sick. So it is raining a bit, but this viewpoint looks insane. How are we doing team? Good. Oh, they don't sound very excited, but it's, it, is, it is pretty nice view. We're very high up. I'm not sure how far we're gonna walk down, but the waves look huge down there. Okay, it's quite slippery because it is raining on these blue blue staircase. Oh. It's just your flip flops. No. No. Apparently it's not that slippy. I've just got slippery flip flops. I literally fall over all the time, but I'm never getting rid of these. They're just too good. Two pounds from Thailand, so yeah. No, Philippines. Oh, the Philippines. Honestly, guys, this the way down is absolutely crazy. Pretty sketchy, especially if it's raining. And we've got some massive waves down here. Oh, oh. Right, let's go down. I think there's a little waterfall down here into the sea, which is quite cool. So I'm gonna go for a little swim in that little pool down there. And I think the, the waves kind of crash up and it looks pretty cool. I don't think it's too dangerous, but yeah, I'm gonna go check it out and have a little cool down after that hike down. It is pretty tiring walking up here, but definitely worth going down. That natural pool down there is so cool with the waves crashing in, although it was high tide. Um, I'm not sure what the next spot we are going to, but it's gonna be along this coast again, which is a lot less touristy than, you know, Clinking Beach, Diamond Beach, all those places which are more famous here on Nusa Penida. So we have just reached Banner Cliffs which is a very untouristy spot. It's just us here. And some cows. And some cows, which <laughs> charged us last time we came here. They charged us last time, but it's scary. Oh, what's the views like? Is it all right? Oh, wow. That's amazing. It's aqua. It's super cool. very uh, windy and cloudy at the moment so instead of taking photos we're just gonna throw some sticks off the edge so I've got this big one here and I'm not very good at throwing so we'll see how far it goes ready <laughs> <Woo! laughs> <laughs> that just came that straight back well. that was not good <laughs> whoops <laughs> okay so we have just arrived at Tembling and we're getting these scooters down yeah, we don't have any helmets, which is probably not the best, and it is a little wet, but these guys are pros, so we should be okay. Yeah, I think our guide, Tuk Tuk Katuk, is behind us, and yeah, the others are in front. So after that 10 minute bike ride down to Tembling, we're now walking down these stairs. 
Um, honestly, I wouldn't advise going down if it's um, wet like it is now, because honestly, it, is it felt quite slippy and it's just more dangerous, even though they've probably been driving all their lives. Just, yeah, be careful. But this is supposed to be a really cool spot where there's a, a natural pool and a beach. So this should be quite exciting, but we'll see. So we have just reached Tembling Natural Pool and Beach and it looks beautiful actually. It is so wavy around here. It's actually quite crazy, but um, this pool is a lot ni nicer. It looks a lot more chilled out. I'm going to go for a little swim in here and maybe miss the swim on the beach because that looks pretty crazy and I'll probably, you know, get hurt or something. <laughs> Yeah, I'm really glad I filmed that. It's so warm. It's so warm. So we have just finished at Tembling Pool and Forest and Beach and we're going to head back on those bikes back to the top. I actually think going back on the bikes up, up is like a lot safer just because coming down when it's a bit wet, oh, I don't know, it is a little scary. It's much better going uphill. <laughs> So we have just arrived at a mock sunset, but not for sunset, yeah. for lunch. We're going in. So we've just had our food here and look how amazing this is. I've how already dug in, it's very good. Really good, we've got beef redung here and some sort of chicken dish. I don't really know what it is, but it's some sort of chicken dish. But these drinks are non-alcoholic, but they're so good. It almost tastes out as alcohol, doesn't it? Mm. Yes. It's a little too good. Jimmy's like, no way, there's I'm no alcohol. There. I'm Al there. He's already drunk with no alcohol. That's how amazing they are. Anyway, let's dig in. So we are back at Namaste Bungalows where we're staying. And yeah, that was our day to those three much less touristy spots. The last one, Tembling, was more touristy, definitely, compared to the others. But it was really cool, very different. Um, and it was cool having a natural pool and the cliffs and the beach. Thought that was, yeah, definitely a good spot. Just very sketchy going down. I wouldn't recommend going by yourself. And if it's wet, I wouldn't even trust them, even though we did, and it was okay. Um, yeah, but Banner Cliffs and the first spot we went to was really cool as well. So yeah, there you go. Hidden spots in Nusa Penida. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video when we're actually going to be flying home very shortly to Singapore. So we're going to be staying there for 17 hours in the airport. And it's going to be really cool because we're just going to do loads of crazy stuff in the beautiful airport. So yeah, see you then. And then we go back home to the UK for, for a bit of summer. See you there. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next one.